Our program has some great ability, for sure, but we obviously pride ourselves on how smart we play, and how hard we play, and how focused we play. We need those intangibles for us to be able to step out on the floor every single night. I mean, when we walked into the gym, they were already looking at us like, oh, these small kids coming in trying to play us, but I think most of them had their own ego, and their egos were too big because they were committed to go someplace and play D1 basketball. They just think, oh, this is an easy team, it's Bishop Moore, a bunch of prep boys not doing anything, they're not going to beat us. But they don't understand how disciplined we are, how, I, how much IQ we have for the game, and how smart we are, and how aggressive defensively we are, and how we can beat teams uh, by defense. And I think that comes from our team chemistry, just like believing in, in each other and trusting each other on the backside, and also just guarding each other up top. So it's just one of those things where even if we had like someone broke down on defense, we knew we had help on the backside. We faced a lot of adversity in some games, so like st being smart stuff, tough and together would always keep us close for the game and keep us strong. As the games kept going on and on, I think about we got like a certain winning streak. I don't remember the specific number. But like after we got that winning streak, a lot of more people started going to our games and stuff like that. So playing in front of a big crowd is like nervous at first, like in warm ups, you get nervous. But then like as the game goes on, you get more used to it and then like you're, you're fine, you're just playing with your friends. How we had our student section was like the biggest we've ever seen and then just like around the city, people talking about us. So like once you feel the energy in the gym just rising, it just makes your adrenaline go up and you feel like you can do anything. I feel like that's what helped us have this like record-breaking season and I mean to have the whole band there I mean the band was only a football thing because usually the whole student section goes to the football game so once the basketball team started getting better when we had the band there that just made it even more packed and more loud in the gym so Wishmore basketball has been a great experience for me ever since freshman year. Um, I've had a lot of fun, made a lot of friends, uh, lifelong friends, and wouldn't trade it for anything. Yeah, this group, this is probably the, like, this team is probably like a, the most family type team I've always like, or ever been a part of. I've never been a part of a group where like, each person cared about each other. And there was like, no one like, we talked about about like, behind each other's back or anything. Like, we all loved each other. And I think that helped us out on the court and off the court. Just like in practices, we wanted to get better for each other, and then in tight games, we knew like we needed to like get this win, so we like grouped up, and that's when our team chemistry really showed. All right, um, some of the things I learned is like being a good teammate translates to being like a good friend off the court, because I didn't really know like a lot of the players before the season. Everyone's just always on the same page and getting along, just stuff like that, like simple stuff that's not even like basketball related. Just it just kind of made me like feel like a like a family that some bond just can't be broken like those guys I'll just remember them forever so um the life lessons is definitely probably commitment is one thing that I learned the most from this season I think um, over the course of the year I've learned that if you put your mind to something, you can achieve it, you just need to work hard in everything that you do. Probably patience. Um, season's long and challenging, probably just staying patient um, through practices because they weren't always fun. Um, just knowing you're there with your buddies, um, trying to reach the ultimate goal, so just patience. And Bishop Moore being the way they are fundamentally, it's like strong, uh, they taught me you know, the value of hard work and stuff like that. I think playing Bishop Moore basketball would be like, will help me with my worth ethic and like staying on top of things because like to play basketball, you have to have a good work ethic. And I feel like the main thing that I feel like I can take away from my experience in playing with this program is I feel like I've learned a lot, not just as a basketball player, but as a young man. Um, the program's taught me morals, ideals, values that I want to have instilled in my own body and in my own personality for the rest of my life. And I feel like that's all attributed back to the program, my teammates, my coaches, my family, everyone around me. 
Uh, it was kind of a historic season. We didn't just go 20 and five against anybody. We went 20 and five against a great district, won the regular season title against some great programs here locally. We were ranked in the top one or two all season long in the Super 16 in the Orlando Sentinel. Um, you know, we had a couple of miraculous plays again that obviously got great notoriety. We had a lot of close games. We had a lot of big moments. Guys stepped up. A lot of moments that I definitely won't forget, you know, being on Sports Center as a team. Throughout my senior season, I really enjoyed the chance to play basketball again and get close with the guys and just have a fun time playing. Bus rides are fun. They're dangerously fun. Why? Just everyone. It's just, just combining all the personalities on the team, it makes the environment fun. I mean, everyone on the team's great guys. They all have great hearts. It's a good mosh pit of players. Uh, I think the senior season was pretty good. Our record was good. We didn't want it to end that way, but I think overall, like the things we've done these past three years have left a legacy here. Uh, I think we had a bunch of seniors, um, and that kind of brought us all together, uh, knowing that we could give it a shot all together. I feel like there's a lot of, I feel like, potential for even more success than what us as a senior class has brought. I feel like our senior class, the class before us, even the one before them, we've kind of set the foundation for years to come. And I feel like the juniors this year, guys like Austin, Keyshawn, Steven, the new torch bearers, I feel like our class is kind of passing the torch to them and the younger guys. And it's their time to shine, their time to you know, leave their mark on the program. And I feel like there's a lot of room for even more success in the future.